to my third video, I think. Nice that you're watching this one as well. Um, I thought it was time for an update again, because today was my last day here in Santiago, and I'm just watching the last sunset here from my room. It's really beautiful. But yeah, today was my last day, and tomorrow I'm gonna be moving on. Um, I had my last class of Spanish today, uh, which also was special because it was the first time that it was actually me and, and the teacher alone, so it was my first class alone. Um, today was very tough. My head is kind of still smoking because we did learn a lot, and I also learned a lot the last three weeks. It's crazy that three weeks have gone by um, so fast. And that was like, yeah, the first third of my language classes here in South America. And they've gone by so fast, it's just unbelievable. Yeah. Nevertheless, I really had a great time here in Santiago. Um, I did a lot of nice tours through Santiago. I think I almost took everything that I wanted to see here in Santiago. Um, I did those trips alone, um, walking through, mall, through small parts of the city here, uh, yeah, looking at different parts, uh, trying the Chilean food, which is always accompanied with by a lot of meat, mayonnaise, <laughs> and the drinks here are also very sweet, so you do have to get used to them, but from time to time they're quite well, you just have to take care not to, not to gain too much weight, um, so I also tried doing workouts here the last three weeks. Yeah. The only thing I didn't get to see was Temple Baha'i. <laughs> I tried twice, I just came back from a second time and every time I got there they just wouldn't want to let us up. Um, the first time we were a bit too late and this time instead of we need a car, we thought we can walk up there, so I don't know. The temple just doesn't want to, just doesn't want me to visit, so <laughs> I guess that's it. Um, I tried twice. Yeah, but other than that, my experience here in Santiago has been so great. Yesterday, I went up Sky Costanera, which is the highest building in all South America. I think it's about 300 meters. And I watched the sunset there, the sun going down over the city of Santiago, which was just an amazing experience. I still have to realize that I was really on top of that building, and on top of Santiago, and that will take some time. And other than that, my classmates were really cool, I really enjoyed them. I spent a lot of time with my Brazilian classmates. Um, so, if you guys are watching, thank you very much. <laughs> I had a really great time with you. Um, also, outside of the classes, in the evenings, we had dinner together, or tried terremotos, or whatever. It was, it was really, really nice. And I also had a, lot, a few nice, funny, late-night parties with, with the other students here from my house. I, always, I also had the opportunity to get to know a few of them um, a bit better and spend some time with them. They're also very lovely and I'm very grateful that I could be part of them um, right here. Yeah, so three weeks have gone by and now it's time time to go somewhere new. Which, yeah, is going to be exciting again, I thought. It kind of feels, I kind of, yeah, feel a bit like home here um, now. After three weeks, I really liked it here, so I'm also a tiny bit sad to leave already. Um, but yeah, now I got two weeks time to travel through Chile. I will first fly to the south of Chile, uh, to the island called Chiloe, um, which is about a two hour flight from Santiago. And I'll go there tomorrow. My, my flight is I think at 12.30 or quarter to one. And I will spend about one week there and in a town called Puerto Varas, which is a bit more north. So I'll spend six nights there. And then I'll spend, then I'll fly to the north of Chile, to the Atacama Desert and stay in San Pedro de Atacama and Antofagasta, Antofagasta which, yeah, is a totally different climate, it's in the desert but from what I've heard it must be really nice up there and there should be a lot of things to do and to visit so I'm really excited and looking forward to that Yeah, and then I'm up to Peru, I'm going to leave Chile in two weeks and stay in Cusco for three weeks to yeah to have language school again for three weeks to start my second third of this journey here. Um, yeah which is still crazy to think about. 
anyway um, I will keep you updated in the next video and in this video I'll of course show all of the clips that I made through Santiago within the last two weeks since, since the last video has gone by and yeah thank you very much and see you soon